several people who have just come down with COVID, even those who never had it before. Mm -hmm. The latest variants are to blame, and there's worry about hospitals starting to fill up in Oregon. Lisa Bailiff looking into this. She joins us live from downtown Portland. Lisa? Well, this is a bit of a surprise because they thought the COVID peak was the middle of last month. Instead, we are seeing those numbers bump up tremendously. Time to take precautions once again. Right now, transmission is pretty intense in Oregon. The infectious disease expert for the Oregon Health Authority says it's almost impossible to avoid the COVID virus now. 46,000 new COVID cases last month in Oregon split between unvaccinated and vaccinated. Less than 3%, though, of those vaccinated were hospitalized, and most of those patients not in the ICU. Still, more than 400 people with COVID right now in Oregon hospitals, that number expected to climb. Those hospitals have been at or above capacity for a long period of time, uh, you know, just trying to, to catch up on taking care of other diseases. So any pressure on the hospitals right now is, is sorely felt. The latest variants are really good at dodging antibodies from a vaccine or prior infection. The virus has changed enough that the vaccines aren't working as well which means we still need to do everything else that we've always been told to do. We need to wear masks more out in public. I know everybody's tired of it and it's annoying, but it still does work. If you're not vaccinated, vaccines do help it not be as bad. Everybody I saw or I talked to this weekend, they were sick, but they weren't horribly sick. Boosters do give you some protection. Doctors say they often help lessen the symptoms if you get COVID. So what can you do to avoid it? If you really want to avoid it, then you need to avoid being in indoor public gatherings with other people and of course wear your mask. So I think it's really a risk benefit conversation and it's uh, each person has a different level of risk and I you can't predict it unfortunately I don't know when it's going to go away. We don't know if it's going to get worse in the winter time. We don't know if those variants are going to change enough that the vaccines won't work at all or whether we're going to get a new vaccine in the fall. Talk to today who is looking at the numbers says, look, we are expecting it to get worse. Definitely this week going into next week as well. Time to take those precautions if you don't want to stay home and be really sick at the very least. Back to you. All right.